Jagas closed out 2013 with 10 points in 15 minutes against Hofstra. Now it's Cavallo right baseline. Good fake around the defender. Goes off glass and drops it in. One of the rare times that Kelly Robinson will drive in and take the shot, but comes up with two right there. It's 8-2 LIU. A little more than three minutes off the clock here in the first. Now it's Miller, left corner. 15-footer is good against a Wagner team that finished with 58 rebounds in Saturday's victory, or rather, a Central Connecticut team that finished with 58 rebounds against Wagner on Saturday. Basin got the offensive rebound and knocked down the jumper inside of the left elbow, so Sophie on the board as it's taken back by Tejane Malone. No look pass Malone, cutting right side off a beautiful feed from Babe. That time Malone put it in uncontested. Once again, that 1-3-1 one, one press from Central Connecticut State. Not much room for LIU to create scoring opportunities. Basin, left corner three, and she buries it. Thomas and Babe on the floor, the two co-captains for the Blue Devils. The pass to Miller was caught. She goes off the front of the rim and pushes it in. Second shot up, in and out, and it's Whippy in there once again for the rebound. She's leading the break, kicks it out. Myers, 17-footer from the right corner, and she's giving the Blackbirds the lead. Downs comes underneath the hoop from Watrous. It's Babe holding near left corner. Blue Devils right to left, trailing by one. Underneath, they leave her all alone and an easy put in for Amanda Harrington. The scene steps back and banks it in off the left blocks. Second highest output of the season for Bassine. Here's a three from straight on, and that's good. Robinson to the center of the floor. Hands off Whippy. Whippy right elbow. Hands off Bassine. Bassine drives left hand. Goes up in traffic and puts it in. Off the low left blocks, Basine keeps finding room. Final two seconds ticking off. The shot from Babe from about 30 feet is no good. The final horn sounds, and Rich Curlander can clap his hands in delight as the Blackbirds finally get that all-elusive first. First NEC victory. First victory here in Brooklyn. And they defeat the Central Connecticut State Blue Devils 60-51 to on this Monday night here in Brooklyn.